11 and you see I have my uh, sweatshirt on I've worn this for the past few days because it's getting cold guys it is in the evening it is um six o'clock like 5 57 so you might as well say six o'clock and it's chilly now it's not really cold but for me because I've been such um, so accustomed to the high 80s and in the evening it's just like the the 70s low 70s or mid actually higher than that um, the low seven low 80s to high 70s it's been so warm but now it's chilly and today guys it rained really really hard it started last night and I was so worried about the chickens but then I kept looking up information it was like they'll be fine so today I noticed that they um, will go in and out of the coop a little bit more but they are fine but today I've got a huge job let me show you That's the greenhouse cover. Um, I'm going to try to put this on my greenhouse. And it's going to be challenging. I um, would like for my husband to help me. But right now, he has not got home from work yet. So, I want to still try to do it the best I can. So, in my mind, I'm thinking if I somehow attach part of this to the shade cloth as I pull the shade cloth it should pull this up and over it so we're gonna try it and we're gonna see if it works if it doesn't work <laughs> don't laugh so this is what I was holding it together I'm trying to untie it because I would like to use this again because I feel like there's something that I could do so I could use it. It's not gonna work. It's not gonna work because I thought that at the bottom of the greenhouse there were little grommets. Um, I don't think at the bottom, but I remember or not at the bottom. So I'm gonna have to try to find and figure out another way to do this. But the first thing I will have to do is take the shade cloth down. So that's what I'm gonna get ready to do. I'm gonna take that shade cloth down now. So one thing I had to do is I've got to start cutting some things. I just thought I would show you. I had this attached to here so that it would help hold it down so I had to cut that off and then um 
I clip this one and I clip that one and uh, I've got more to clip so that's what I'm doing now clipping those off so that one's done and I gotta get this one clipped off so I'll just clip all the outer edges and then I'll pull it off okay so I got most of the top but even at the bottom I've got to cut those so I'm going along now and cutting the ones on the bottom so it's just about off I just have to kind of pull it to this side oh it looks like down there it's caught so let me go over there and cut that one I missed so happy that is really really a really good thing to have here where I live um, because it gets so hot and humid at the height of the summer and so it protected all of that um, if it had if I had not had it a lot more things would have burned up not produced and it did very well I've had that um, shake off for going on three years so, and it does have it is showing its wear it's got some holes a few holes but I'm going to fold it up and put it in storage for next summer. So now I need to figure out how I'm going to get that uh, greenhouse cover on it. And I'll show you if I'm successful or not. Y'all see this? It is on. And let me tell you, it was not an easy job. And I am happy I did not film it because man oh man I was one hot mess trying to get this on and at the last moment I figured out how to do it so what I had to do was I got to that end there and I used the long hoe to lift it over this part that was nine inches so once I got it across the first part then I pulled it on each side I pulled it on the left and I pulled it on the right then I pulled it up to the second part and pushed it over and I got it done in any event I need to now go throughout the greenhouse and I need to do this I need to secure these because it's going to be windy and it looks very flimsy but guys these things really work so I need to uh, go ahead and do that. This side is good. And I need to um, kind of pull that down a little bit more and uh, get it done. So, oh, it was a job. I will say that I am seriously considering getting a greenhouse built next year. That's what I want to do. 
I want to start planning for that because it will be in the same spot. It will be, um, I guess, wood and polyurethane. I don't know. Um, I have to figure it out. I have to do some research. But yeah, that is what I want to do because this cover off and on, uh-uh, it's not for the business. It's really not. I'm sitting here picking these. Uh, let me show you. I'm picking them off. And just dropping them in there so I can pick them up when I finish. This makes such good jam. These uh, calamondin oranges. It's nice with some homemade biscuits. Man, it's delicious. Delicious. And it's not even hard to make. Maybe I'll do a video of making um, jam with these. All right. So let me go ahead and uh, secure these.